story. So this one is dedicated to someone. Uh, she inspired me. Um, okay, some of you may see me here. I look too young to some of you, right? I have a baby face, so. But I'm engaged. I have proposed, so. Yep. She couldn't be here, but uh, yeah. This is an inspiration to her. I, I'm very sure she would see it on YouTube, but I don't know. So here it goes. It's called The Eleventh Hour You Made. So, so here it goes. I was so lavish. Maybe a playboy. Hmm. But then you came around in your glory, in your past, and you gave me butterflies. Mm. Should I speak on that? Let's see. I watched you from afar as you were painting. Your mind is picture perfect. Your face is picture perfect. But don't get it twisted. You swept me off my feet. Mm. But that's not the point I want to make. You see, the point I want to make is you stand out from the rest, but that's not all you stand out. Just you. You see, I've written rhymes and rhymes of poems, or God knows I've written and written, but why do I have shivers when I try to write about you? Care to explain, miss? Or should I say, love? Hmm. You see, you are the kind of woman that will grace the ground that you sweep off your feet. You are the kind of woman that just commands whatever is under your feet without saying any word because you are just words unspoken, but too loud. So permit me to ask you one more time, what have you done to this boy's heart? Mm. You see, I'll always be the ground you stand upon. I'll always be who you want me to be, but that doesn't mean I have my doubts, but those fear are only because this love is pounding and pounding in my mind. I've written and read letters, but those letters are unfinished because you are too much to describe. So lady, this promise may seem unfinished, but guess what? Those four little words will be the ones to complete it. So girl, I'm in it to be in it forever. So come correct because this heart is yours. Thank you.